Hello, I'm Katherine Roberts from YourArtImage.com with a quick marketing tip for artists in five minutes or less, which is now posted each Thursday rather than Tuesday. If you'd like to be sure that you don't miss each video tip, just fill in your email address in the box on the right-hand side of your screen where it says follow blog via email on my WordPress site, and you'll be sent an email each time a new video is posted. Right, and as a perfectly unplanned segue, what I want to talk about today is customer confusion, or perhaps more accurately, the importance of clarity. Um, there's a common saying in sales and marketing that is, confused customers don't buy. And you may be saying to yourself, I don't really see how that applies to me as an artist, I don't sell directly, etc. Um, but it's actually relevant to every aspect of every business. Uh, if you have a website or a profile page on an online gallery, it is imperative that you make it clear to the visitor exactly what it is you do and perhaps more importantly, what it is that you want them to do. For example, you may not sell artwork directly from your website, but you hopefully want to keep in touch with everyone who visits your site and is interested in your artwork so that in the future you can tell them when, how, and where they can buy your artwork. In this scenario, the one thing that you want the visitor to do is to join your mailing list, and that should be stated very clearly, and it should be very obvious to the viewer how to do that one thing. Sign up for your newsletter. It should be very simple and easy to do. Most people use their website as a general source for providing information about themselves or their business, which is useful to a point, but it doesn't lead directly to sales. If you want to grow your business and increase your profit and revenue, you need to be more proactive than just having a website that informs. And if you do sell from your website, either finished artwork or commissions, you need to make that process and how one initiates the process very, very obvious, very clear and straightforward. Because at each and every point of hesitation, which is usually caused by confusion, you risk losing the sale or the prospective client. Now this same idea applies to networking. For example, when you're introducing yourself or telling someone what you do, be sure you end with what it is you're looking for or want from them. For example, Hi, I'm a portrait painter and I'm always happy to speak with families or businesses who are in need of a unique gift to mark a special occasion. If you know anyone um, like that, please be sure to mention them to me. Mention me to them or give them my details. So in other words, you're introducing yourself, but you're also saying who it is that you market to or who it is you're looking for as a client. Another example, if you're participating in shows or live events and believe after talking, or more importantly, listening to a prospective client that they are really interested in buying something, you need to make sure that you are asking for the sale. In other words, specifically saying, I'm happy to write that up for you. Or something like, I've really enjoyed you stopping by. It's been a very, very busy, um, it's been very busy this weekend. And if you really love this piece or like what you see, please don't think about it for too long or let me wrap it up for you now. Because I just can't tell you how often with one-off original artwork people are disappointed because they hesitated and they are looking and what they were looking at is gone when they come back for it and they miss the chance to own something that they really love. You can be very direct when you are being sincere. Um, and it's important that people understand what it is they need to do in order to take the next step. So that's it. Whether online or in person, make it very clear what you want the prospect to do and make it easy for them to do. I'm Katherine Roberts from YourArtImage.com and I want you to sign up to follow my blog by entering your email address on the web page. Then you won't miss any of my marketing tips for artists in five minutes or less. Thanks.